Hello everybody, Hannah and I'm here. It's early in the morning before we get rolling with the stream for the day. Uh, what I wanted to do today was give, bring a little video to you. It's going to break it down into a few sections. A little bit about me, a little bit about the stream, what's going on with the stream and where we want to take it. So uh, let's get started on it. So who is this NFNM character, you may be asking yourself? Well, that is me. And who am I? Uh, I was born and raised in Canada, where I spent a lot of my life gaming. Uh, I was never the greatest at it, but I always had some fun. Um, and it eventually led to some big changes in my life. When I was living with my older brother in Calgary, I, we used to play Team Fortress 2, which is where I actually met my lovely wife about five years ago. I was running a heavy, she was running a medic, and, you know, game talk leads to personal talk, leads to me flying down to the States and us getting married down here. Um, and now, where we are today. Why do I stream? That's a bit of a two-parter. Um, personally, for me, I've been gaming for a while, and it hit a point where it was kind of stale. It was missing something, and oddly enough, it was around the Guitar Hero period where things started to change a little bit for that. But then once all that kind of went away, it went back to feeling a little stale. Now, it's going to sound weird that Guitar Hero for gaming, that's really where your most entertaining point was. I, when I was growing up, I wasn't the most popular of people, but I had fun entertaining. Um, I was in a couple different bands in high school that were not extraordinary by any means. Some would say maybe half decent, but we'd get up on stage and I just have fun entertaining people rocking out. It didn't matter how bad it sounded. I was into it, having fun, and it helped other people have fun. And later on, in around 2009 ish, yeah, 2009, I ran, briefly ran a show on Blog TV where I just get on and I talk with people and talk about things and rant and rave and never anything like too bad, but it was just the entertaining aspect. And that's where Twitch has kind of freshened up some of that for me, where I can play a game that I may have played a lot of times before and just the interaction with people, it brings a whole new element to it. And just knowing that I can entertain some people it brings me a heightened level of enjoyment and entertainment out of the game. What's the schedule? That's a good question and such a weird word to look at. Um, what I generally try to do is a chunk of NHL in the morning, call it early morning exhibitions where I do solo play. I've started with the Hockey Ultimate Team, building up some coins. And what I want to do with that is build up some coins and eventually do a giveaway on the stream once I get enough coins to work the auction house a little bit and get some players that are half decent. Then I try to move to a two hour chunk of either some random game, usually on Tuesdays we're throwing Diablo in there, that's kind of up in the air, um, or we'll run it as an extended period for the game of the week. Uh, the game of the week, of course, this week is how to survive, but it will be changing. If we hit 100 followers, it'll be that dying light stream on there with a little bit of a twist. More details on that later. But um, what I, well, I'll touch on that next part in the next segment here. Typically, I'm streaming from I'm going to go from Tuesday to Saturday, as I am unemployed right now and don't have much else to do. So that's what we're running with for now. Hmm. Well. I'm glad you asked. I do have a couple big ideas. Um, I have to tiptoe around some of them lightly, but the big thing that I want to bring to the stream is a lot of more interaction with the viewers. I try to do as much as I can with interaction via chat, but I want to get to the point where it's you guys that are picking the games of the week. And I want to do a couple twists within some of those where I'll have a designated one that I'll do for a game of the week. But It'll have a little twist as to how you guys can interact with it. I can't say much about that right now, but as the stream begins to grow, then I can start revealing a few more details and I can start rolling out some of these projects and ideas. But I ask that you please stay with me and please refer your friends. The more people we have, the better this will work. Trust me on this one. Please. Um, 
the short answer for that one is not yet. Um, I'm not on a dedicated connection as of right now, so uh, it slows down the multiplayer aspect of it in terms of in-game and it lags out the broadcast. So not yet, but I do have plans of working on a couple of things to get some groups together for like Sunset Overdrive and doing viewer versus for NHL and eventually Madden when I put it in there. Um, so not yet, but stay tuned. It will be in there at some point. Not yet, but soon, hopefully. Well, maybe, maybe soon, hopefully. Well, that was really more questions than I had signed up for originally, but uh, thanks for all the interest and everything. Um, all I want to say is thank you again to everybody out there, and especially if you've tuned into the broadcast, and not only that, actually stayed through this entire thing. I'm not sure I've even watched this far into it. I don't know what half the stuff back there was, but uh, thank you for all your support, your kind words, and... Um, Let's keep doing what we're doing. It's been an awesome time so far, and I hope it continues to roll on and keep getting better. So uh, big shout out to all of you in the community, and you know who you are. You right there. Not the camera, but the person on the other side of that screen. Anyway, thanks for watching. Um, as always, game on. <laughs>